Well, what's up guys? DK here with Collector's Impact and today, man, we've got a special treat. <laughs> we have a Marvel Universe Series 3 sealed box. Well, almost sealed box. <laughs> and this is, uh, I'll, I'll go ahead and explain that. So this is the 1992 Marvel Universe Series just for reference here. So you can see it's almost sealed because I actually tore the seal and pulled one pack out of it already and used it in another video where I was talking about looking for PSA 10s fresh out of a pack. So if you're interested in seeing that video and the very first pack of this opened, uh, link is in the description. It's not a requirement by any means, but if you're interested in that and that topic, there it is for you. So, uh, <laughs> Anyway, I figured we'll go ahead and jump into this box and see if we can get some decent holograms and maybe some good rookies, like Ant-Man's rookie card is in here, and of course, dun, 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 Carnage. Carnage's rookie card is in this set. So let's see if we can get some nice gradable versions of those cards. And, and the artwork in here is pretty cool in general, but the, the biggest problem with this freaking 92 Marvel Universe set is the printing quality was total sh I don't know what they were thinking, but it is just, it is sh-tastic. <laughs> so let's go ahead and crack into this. Let's remove the, you can tell it's genuine with the Impel branding on the seal and everything. So we've got ourselves a genuine box. And uh, yeah, let's see, let's see how this goes. Now, for this particular video, yeah, I'm only going to open up half of the box just because these take me forever to open because I'm, I'm the type of person where I love going through them and looking at all the cards in detail and ooing and aahing at them. So <laughs> hopefully you guys don't mind that too much. So this will be a two-part video, and it saves you some time in your day as well. So you can come back another day and finish out the box opening if you are inclined to do so, which would be great. I'd, I'd appreciate that. So if you like these packs, definitely come back for the part two. And then, of course, there will be more follow-up videos showing the cards that I'm choosing out of these for grading. And they will likely be going to SGC and uh, getting slabbed and everything. Obviously, not every card, but uh, the best ones will absolutely be getting graded. as That's kind of the name of the game right now. I've been selling a few graded cards and keeping some, and it's just a wild time out there in the market. It really is. It's all over the place, which I'm not going to lie. I love it. <laughs> One thing I don't love is this thing, wrapper. They love this, like, really flexible, weird kind of plastic. I'm so used to, like, Magic and Pokemon-style stuff where it's foil, and this is, like, that... that plastic and I'm just always afraid of damaging the cards so I'll probably be skipping through a lot of the actual like raw tearing of these things because it takes a billion years <laughs> all right so we've got spider-man and daredevil thor and corp cores oh thor cores uh wolverine and cable alpha fight that's pretty cool I like that one. The Alpha Fight card is nice. Uh, Iron Man with his uh, helmet off and everything. An Origins card. Okay. Uh, Eternity. That's nice. Multiple Man. Uh, Mr. Fantastic. Black Panther. Talon. Uh, Shiva. Sabretooth. These are actually in decent quality. I can't lie. These are decent. I mean, they're, they're all kind of bent, but... You can put some stuff on top of them, like a book or whatever, and get them kind of flattened as much as you can, at least. <laughs> ah, looky right there, you guys. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and pull that one out and inspect it. Uh, yeah, I mean, overall, this one is actually really solid. Um, okay, hang on. One minute, 37 seconds later. Yeah, overall, this is great. I'm going to estimate this is this is at least a 9. I would think even a 9.5 on this. A 10 is a Hail Mary, but, you know, seeing as how it came right out of that pack, it is possible, but it's a gamble. I'm going to estimate 9 or 9.5, but that is worth grading, as it is the rookie card. So, awesome hit already. Doctor Strange, that's nice too. Hulk and Thing, All Hulks Unite, X-Faction, The New Warriors, Archangel, Nomad, Multiple Man, Blackout, 
and Kingpin. <laughs> I love me some Kingpin. That's great. That's awesome. <laughs> I've got to do some more research on this set in particular and see if there are any that are, um, see if there are other ones. I know Carnage is a big hitter. I know he is. Um, so I'd be interested to see some of the others as well. All right, Captain Britain, Quicksilver, Power Man and Iron Fist, Sauron, Sauron, hmm. <laughs> Dracula, freaking Dracula, what the heck? Okay, Green Goblin, Wolverine again, Spider-Man and Wolverine, uh, Rogue, that's a pretty card, very nice, Thor, Epoch, and the Collector. Oh, look at that. <laughs> it's our mascot card. <laughs> Got the Collector. Okay, Feral. Long Shot. Megan. That's a nice art. Strong Guy. Really strong guy. Mr. Sinister. Maelstrom. Hulk. Sleepwalker. Punisher and Daredevil. Mad Thinker. Diablo, and follow the kingpin. Okay. Yep, overall really liking the uh, the feel and flavor of the set. Definitely enjoying the full art aspect of it. Some of the cards you can tell right away are of much higher quality than others. Uh, you know, namely you can tell the bad quality ones right away. So, let's see. I've never been a huge fan of the sideways ones. Wolverine, Ghost Spider, or Ghost Spider, damn. Ghost Rider and Punisher. Uh, who do we got? Look, there's a lot of these team up ones Magneto and Doctor Doom, Cyclops. Uh, okay, that's an interesting one. So it's Wolverine in the um, in the chamber there. <laughs> that's that's kind of cool. Uh, there's Ego. Okay, that could go with my Guardians of the Galaxy cards. I've been like putting together some sets of Guardians of the Galaxy stuff so that might be kind of a nice one. And I think that actually is Ego's rookie card. So I'm going to set that aside. Okay, Mr. Fantastic again. Black Panther. Hulk. The Rose. Wedding of Spider-Man. And Infinity Gauntlet. I'm pretty eager to see a hologram, guys. What about you? <laughs> I want to I want to pull one of those. Uh, I haven't actually held a hologram from this set in my hands in a long time, so that would be nice. So let's see. Come on, give us a hollow. Uh, what the heck is this? An amazing triple offer from Marvel. <laughs> okay, so we can get a binder and a tin and a shirt, you guys. Just fill out your information and send it to nowhere because you know that stuff's been out of date for a long time. <laughs> cool. Punisher, Wolverine, Jean Grey. I'm just going to start flipping through them at this point. You guys know these. You guys know them. There's the Invisible Woman. Uh, that's actually pretty nice. Blackout, Kingpin, and hell yes, another Carnage card. Oh, man. <laughs> a little longer than a few minutes later. Yeah, that's actually really cool. So two Carnages already. That's great. I mean, he's the star of this set, so uh, definitely happy to have that. That's pretty lucky. And this one, again, would be definitely a nine at least. So it's good to send in multiples, get you, get you that multiple gamble. <laughs> All right, this pack feels lucky. This pack feels lucky, you guys. Let's see. Ah, Captain America. That's, uh, yeah, that's a nice one. I've, I've been wanting... A, uh, a 10 of that, though this one I can tell its corner is already, it's damaged right out of the pack, so that's probably not it. There's Iceman and Captain Britain. Dracula, Destroyer. Yeah, the little team ones. Iron Man, that's a nice Iron Man too. <laughs> Pretty solid, good condition. I'm going to set that aside. I'll set aside Cap. Inferno, uh, Guardians of the Galaxy. That's cool, too. A pretty sweet card. And Daredevil. The in-betweener. <laughs> Giggity. Definitely 
<laughs> make some jokes there. Human Torch, Thor. Oh, the Thor is cool too. Man, Wolverine. Oh, that's a nice Wolverine too. Yeah, that one's in great condition. That's in really good shape. So is this Thor. These are solid hits. Solid, solid hits. Omega Red. There's Green Goblin. Also in decent shape. Uh, Sleepwalker, Punisher, X Men, and the In Betweener. Yeah. <laughs> Thing, Colossus, Warlock. What is this? Ha <laughs> ha! Yeah. Okay. I gotta put it in a sleeve. Five minutes later. Very solid pull. We've got the Hulk. The Hulk hologram, though, you can see right there at the top. Some cutting machine damage. Ooh, impossible to get a 10. Uh, I'd even say a 9 is kind of on the border with that. Maybe an 8.5, um, though a 9 a nine would make it pretty solid, but I could see 8.5 being the grade on that. Uh, right out of the freaking pack as an 8.5, you guys. <laughs> but I'll be sending that in for sure. Uh, that's my first hologram from this set, so that's really cool. I also personally think that it should count for a lot that there's no scratches on the card. Uh, you know, like, it didn't have time to get scratched, number one. Number two, it was actually manufactured decent aside from the top there, those issues at the top. There's actually no scratches on this, which is pretty rare, actually. Oh, there's Ant-Man's rookie. That's cool. Yep, Ant-Man. Boom. There's his rookie. Sunfire, Gambit, The Rose, and The Wedding of Spider-Man. <laughs> oh, is it a team card, though? Damn it. Yeah. Juggernaut and Black Tom. Charles, you got my head. Gotcha, oh. bitch. Mm, yeah, now what, mother Charles, Got my pimp cane, bitch. <laughs> I was hoping, oh, it's the Juggernaut. I really wanted a, a single Juggernaut. Hopefully he's in here as a single card. Captain America, Nomad. There's the Avengers. That's a pretty sweet one. Uh, there's Hulk with, like, a freaking mushroom cloud. <laughs> pretty cool. Uh, Galactus, Deathhawk, Shadowcat, Ghost Rider, Cyber, Puppet Master... And the coming of Galactus. Oh, sh**. God, I'm all... I, I <laughs> punched my camera. <laughs> oh, well. Damn. Yeah, hopefully that didn't mess anything up. <clears throat> Hulk and the Thing. Got some other stuff. Magneto and Doom. Cardiac... Oh, 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 oh. It's upside down. So does that mean it's a hollow? Yes, it's H2, the Thing. Let's leave it up. Two thousand years later. Damn, man, this one is actually really nice too. Kind of hard to see. That's the thing with these, but huh, the thing, yeah, pun not intended. But <laughs> yeah, it's kind of hard to see the image, especially not in person. But it is pretty nice. Um, but I do like that it's a different color. It's copper colored to match his actual like um, brick, whatever you. I think that's his brick. You know, rock his rock color. That's really cool. Whereas the Hulk is green. That's a nice touch that they're different colors like that. Same exact manufacturing defect, though, so it, it can't get a 10. And this one's got a bit more edge wear than the Hulk as well. So, damn. Still, it is nice to have it not scratched and stuff, but I'm going to, I bet that's like an 8 in that condition. That's why those perfect 10s go for so much, guys, especially from SGC, as SGC does not mess around. That Psylocke is really nice. Going to set that aside. Uh, Professor X, you got in my head, Charles. <laughs> I like that one too. Uh, silhouette, hate monger. That's pretty cool. I really like this set. I like all the random little side B characters. There are probably a lot of rookie cards in this actually. Now that I'm looking through it, I just don't know off the top of my head, other than Ant Man and uh, Carnage, of course. But and ego, I know those, but I don't, I don't know the others. Can order more T-shirts, guys. Uh, Namorita, that actually is a rookie card too. I remember that one. Uh, Namor, that's cool. Uh, Wolf Spain, Gideon. There's Magneto. These ones look a little bit rougher. Um, the quality of the the cards from this pack. There's the checklist, you guys. Never a complete pack opening without the checklist. 
All right, we're getting down, we're getting down there in packs, guys. So I'm hoping we get at least one more hologram. It's always nice to pull at least three holograms per half box. So I'm thinking, thinking we will, but you just never know. Uh, Havoc, Siren, Cable, Silver Mane, Hobgoblin, Silver Surfer. That one's good too. Hmm. Okay. Yep. Cannonball. Some more of those. Operation Galactic Storm and Captain America Origins one where he was little, little wimp and then made big. I like that one too. That, uh, I don't know. I don't know what kind of value that would pack as a graded card. But, and I don't even know if that would get a 10. I see some wear on it. Cyclops. I feel like there's something in this, you know? <laughs> It's kind of spongy. <laughs> I don't know if that's good or not. Human Torch, Thor, Kingpin, Sabretooth, Mega, no, Wonder Woman, no, no. Ooh, ooh, Phoenix. Uh, Phoenix is one of my favorite cards to grade. So that might be, that might be one just to add to my collection of Phoenix cards. Puppet Master, nope. Uh, false alarm. I really thought there was something in there. You can see right there that gap. I really is it? Did I miss it? Is there a foil there? Uh, no, no foil. Oh, uh, but there's a Mor uh, Morbius. He's supposed to be um, pretty desired too these days. Okay. All right, guys. Three packs left. Three packs left. Let's see. Can we do it? Can we get the hollow? Come on. Or another Carnage. I'll take that, too. <laughs> uh, Domino, Doctor Strange. Yeah, Fantastic Four and the Avengers. There's Rogue again. Polaris, Blaze, Thor. Epoch, the Collector again. And that one's centering is a little better, but no, it's still off. If I can find a perfectly centered Collector, since they decided to go ahead and put a dang border around him... <laughs> I'll I'll get it, but if it's uh if it's not perfectly centered, it's not gonna pull that ten. All right, Nick Fury, Storm, Daredevil, Doctor Doom, uh, no, 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 Rogue again, Bishop and Slug, nasty. All right, guys, last pack. Can we do it? Can we pull off a hologram in the last pack? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. If my friend Ivan was here, he could. <laughs> Dude's luck is unlike anything I've ever seen. All right, let's see. Uh, Wolverine, Punisher, uh, Cage, Zarko, Thanos. Hey, that's a good hit. I'll take that. I'll definitely take that. Much later. Yeah, I mean, let's look at this Thanos. That's actually really, really nice. Uh, that might be a little bit of damage down there. Let's see. Uh, you know, I don't, I don't know. That might be the artwork. Like the yellow stars and stuff. That might be the artwork. Yeah. Um, this is looking super crispy to me. Oh man, this is a good candidate. I really like the artwork on this 92 Thanos too. This, uh, there's a little dot there. Oh God. <laughs> Look at how freaking meticulous you have to get with this crap. It's probably a 9.5, but still probably worth grading. Yep. 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 Definitely not a bad hit. That's a good way to end the pack. If we don't have anything else, let's go and explore the rest of that last pack. So we had Wolverine, Punisher, Cage, Zarko, Maelstrom, Spider-Man. Huh. Man, this last pack is the pack that keeps on giving, you guys. <laughs> Six and a half hours later. The front of this one is super clean, but the back has your typical cutting error right there. Damn. Always right there. What is their deal right there? <laughs> okay. Still, that could probably pull a 9.5. All right, let's see. Let's see the re Hey, Vision and Scarlet Witch. <laughs> Dude, this pack keeps giving. <laughs> Flashback. Let's go ahead and find out. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Uh -huh. 
Yeah, okay. <laughs> PSA 9. Oh, no 10 there, so. End of flashback. Yeah, that's a pretty popular card from the set, too. Um, yep, same errors that my other copy of it had to hang from my original collection. They just love those cutting errors. All right, Avengers West Coast and Captain America again as a wimp, so. Okay, there we go. So, <laughs> overall, I am pretty stoked with the results of this this first half of the box. Ant-Man Rookie, two Carnage Rookies. Oh, my God. Two Holograms, Spider-Man, Vision and Scarlet Witch, Thanos, all with good potential, plus the ones down here, too. I mean, this was... This was not a bad, not a bad opening at all. So, all right, guys. Well, that wraps up the video for today. I thank you very much for coming by and checking out this video. And remember, if you liked it, please remember to give it a nice thumbs up as it greatly helps with the channel and the algorithms and all of that kind of stuff. And uh, if you want to see the second half of the box opening, as well as, of course, other videos related to this, and definitely when I send them off for grading and the grade reveals and stuff, please subscribe to the channel. Would greatly appreciate that if you haven't already done so. I'm trying to reach that 1,000 subscriber mark, if possible, and would really appreciate it. So <laughs> thanks again for coming by, and I hope to see you again next time. Take care.